This is Kharkiv's main museum. Staff are racing to get priceless artworks to safety as Russian forces pound the city with artillery and airstrikes. Many of them were created by Russian artists. Marina Falatova is head of the foreign art department there. There are more than 25,000 items in our collection. Kharkiv Fine Art Museum's collection is one of the biggest in Ukraine, one of the most valuable. It is simply the irony of fate that we should be saving Russian artists, paintings by Russian artists from their own nation. This is simply barbarism. Moscow launched what it calls a special military operation in Ukraine on February 24th to destroy its neighbor's military capabilities. Ukraine and its allies call Russia's actions a brutal invasion that has killed hundreds of civilians and forced millions to flee abroad. The ornate museum building in Kharkiv is still standing, unlike many others in the city. Falatofa and her colleagues were relieved that the art collection remained intact. But windows have been blown in by the blasts, making it impossible to control the temperature and humidity inside the gallery, vital for preserving the paintings. Falatova said this was where one of the museum's most prized paintings, Russian painter Ilya Repin's reply of the Zaporozhian Cossacks, once stood. It has been taken down to be stored safely. Repin's painting, basically, it should not be moved. Temperature or humidity conditions are not recommended. Any movement should be avoided. We treat it with great care, but there is not a single window intact in this room. Thank God there is no damage that no one can see, but the real damage we will only be able to assess in a peaceful time when it is calm. And of course, art restorers will look at all these works and it will be necessary to restore them. 